Brothers and sisters of the celestial energy, it's Brother Wisdom. The word I wanted to, to expose is insurrection. Insurrection means the etymology of insurrection is to rise up. Okay, that is the etymology of insurrection. The definition of insurrection means to rise up against a, a, a government or an authority. All right? That definition pretty much is for these arc beings because they rise up against the authority, um, the authoritative figures. And the etymology belongs to us because we rise up on the inside. And our rising up on the inside causes us to rise up on the outside. That's the symmetry of it all. When you're rising up on the inside, you're realizing that everything that you learn in your life is a lie. All right. That's why. Um, well, I, I saw I saw a couple a couple people in the last video say, "How do you awaken?" All right. Your awakening begins when you rise up on the inside of you. When you realize that everything around you is a lie. The money, the clothes, the cars, the job positions, the uh, the, the the religions, all that. When you realize that it's a lie. We had a creed called Islam, I self law and master, which means that uh, which which meant that we created our own reality. So therefore, which that which we saw within ourselves, we created it on uh, uh, on the inside of us, and it manifested on the outside. That's how we had so many tall structures, the the pyramids, the the the, the monuments, the the the, the colossal uh, uh, um, uh, chapels, the, the castles that we had built. We saw them on the inside of us, and they manifested on the outside. But it all happens when you are at that point of insurrection. When you're rising up on the inside of you. You know, I was asleep in the church for quite some time. And I had brought I have been brought up in the church. And to be honest with you guys, I've been awakened for almost let me see. It's been close to 20 years I've been awakened. No, 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 I'm sorry. It's been close to 10 years that I've been awakened, all right? But in that in the awakening, what I learned was the, the whole point of time doesn't exist. Energy is everything. This is what I learned. So I began to rise up in myself. Now, when I was in the church, I was struggling. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Help me, Lord. Hear my prayers. Hear me now. And the more I prayed, the less things happened for me. And I was struggling. I could not. I mean, I, I couldn't buy a bucket. All right. Me and my family were struggling. I mean, I came to the point where I was getting me and my wife and I was getting state aid for 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 a short amount of time. All right. And. What I realized was something had to happen. There was a, I was on a Facebook, I was in a Facebook group. Um, I forgot which Facebook group I was in, but there was a sister, a sister and a brother who came on the, who was in the group and they said, um, you talking all this, they say, you got some knowledge, but you need to go into meditation. You need to learn how to link it to yourself. And that was um, about 10 years ago. Yep, that was about 10 years ago. And I said, link into myself. I said, hmm. I said, okay. So my first time I'm going to meditation they introduced me to Sofagio Frequencies and I started searching more and another brother said, listen to Sofagio Frequencies. So I, I put up Sofagio Frequencies on YouTube and it just so happened that I came across this one meditation video and I, I came up to, I think I put in the, the thing, how to meditate. And there was this Asian guy 
that was on there and he did some information on how to meditate and it linked with me because it seemed so close to me and that's when I realized a lot of these Asian guys they had stolen a lot of our knowledge you know later on I realized that they are not our people that they stole a lot of our knowledge and was using our information and even though they were using our information they were they they were not living forever the way we used to live but I did it and that's when I made the decision to leave the church and I left the church for good and I went, I I started listening to so so Fagio frequencies and, and I forgot which frequency I pulled up I went into the bathroom cuz I had to use the bathroom that day you know I had to take a dump and I'm on the toilet with my earbuds in my ear and listen to these frequencies and I think the, the, the frequency lasted for about 20 minutes but I went into the quantum realm and see this was a part of my awakening this is a part of me rising up on the inside I went into the quantum realm and there I went through the cosmos. I saw galaxies and planets and energies and powers and I saw I saw uh, 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 planets being born and I saw starburst and and um, um, different types of, 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 of powerful uh, 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 flames and 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 comets and all. I, I saw this as I was traveling through the cosmos and. Then I went through this mountainous area and I'm traveling through this mountain area and I see all these mountains and valleys and 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 just just I mean it was it was just beautiful. See all these mountains and valleys and then I saw these brothers, these brothers uh, just sitting around talking and they looked over at me and I looked at them and I still remember the brothers faces. I still remember these faces the, the faces to this day right now. That was 10 years ago. And I still remember the brothers' faces. And um, then I went to another area. It was just completely, it was complete darkness. It was just nothing but total darkness. And I was like, wow. I thought I was there for a couple hours. Now I'd only been there for 20 minutes. And later on, I realized that I was in the quantum realm. But that was a point of insurrection for me. That was a point that I had to rise up within myself and realize that. So once I, and that's, that's when I started linking into myself, I started learning about myself, I started going into meditation, I started tapping into my inner energies. And just after I, start, I started doing that, my wife said, well, I'm going to fill out a couple of credit cards because, you know, we're, we were looking for a house at the time. And... Um, she said, I'm going to fill out a couple credit cards. I said, okay, cool. Go ahead and fill out the credit cards. Da, 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 da. I was accepted for 14 different credit cards. <laughs> I swear, but when I was in the church, I could not get a credit card for nothing. When I was depending upon Jesus and God and this Holy Spirit that doesn't exist. All right. When I was going, giving my money to this church. All right. I couldn't get nowhere. I couldn't do nothing. I was literally struggling, trying to read the Bible, trying to trying to pick up prayer books and all. Oh, just like you did with such, 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 such. And I'm reading off of just like the prayer book and all said. And then it just hit me on the inside. This never happened. I say I'm praying, but nothing is happening. So that's when the awakening happened for, happened for me because I realized that everything that happened for me happened by my hands and no, no one else but me. That's when, I, when my awakening happened. And there had to be a point of insurrection. The insurrection is rising up within yourself to realize that everything around you is a lie. Everything around you is a lie. If it's not nature, it's a lie. The cold weather is a lie. Because our planet is Kai. Kai means fire and energy. So our planet is a fiery planet. So these beings are creating this cold weather. It's a lie. 
The money is a lie because we don't need money to get things. All these buildings and businesses are lies. All these corporations and churches, entities, banks, they're lies. The schools are lies. Even this car that we were driving in, we spoke with the 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 the. the the machinery that we had was totally different because the machinery relied on our, on the energies of our bodies and we didn't have to take the, the, the blood from the planet because the machinery that we have depended on the magnetism of our planet. These beings offset everything. These so-called white people are lies. The artificial intelligence. The Bible is a lie. The religion are lies original religion that we had was was called Islam I self law and master and, and therefore we conjured and channeled energies from our bodies and we manifested things right, in, right, right there in our faces this is a point where you have the awakening where you realize that you have been living a lie the police department, the judges, the, the so-called justice department, the prison system, the, the, the law department, the lawyers, the, 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 the politicians, the government, the constitution, they're all lies. All of them. They're all lies. That's the point of insurrection. You rise up within yourself. That's when you go into meditation and you, and you say within yourself, I am all supreme energy. I am all supreme power. I am the most powerful being known on the planet. There is no one more powerful than I am. I glorify me. I give me all the honor and glory. I give me praise. That's your point of awakening when you realize that the praises belong to you and not to someone on the outside of you. The praises belong to you on the inside of you. That's where your praises belong. So that's the point of insurrection. When you rise up and you awaken to the true knowledge of who you really are. That's the point of insurrection. This is what is being taught through my vessel. My vessel teaches our people how to depend upon self, self-reliance. Don't believe in me, believe in you. Don't look for me to send out supreme power. Send you see yourself sending out supreme power. Last night, as I slept in meditation, was sending out different missions to different brothers and sisters. And everyone else, everyone had got a, a, a different mission everyone so understand my people that our insurrection begins when we start the correction of ourselves and that's going within yourself to find all your power and energy that's your point of awakening there's a video um, that I have on YouTube it's, uh, basic Medi remedy H basic meditation all right Remedy H, basic meditation for those who want to learn how to meditate, the proper way to meditate, or what to do, because your meditation is, has nothing to do with time. People say, all, everybody, I mean, not everybody, a lot of people are always saying, well, how much time does it take to do this? How much time does it take to do that? It not, it's not about the amount of time. Time has no bearing on any of this. It's not about the amount of time. It's about the amount of energy that you put into yourself. Your thoughts are your energies that function and makes your meditation either powerful or weak. When you first started your meditation, I seek after the knowledge of the cosmos. I seek after the power and the energy of nature. Now you seek and you, you say seek and you shall find. All right. So now you seeking after it in your beginning meditation, you seek after it and that energy comes to you. Now your next meditation session, you're no longer seeking because you found something new 
All right. You're no longer seeking now in this next meditation. What are you doing? You say, I link into the higher le- higher energies of the cosmos. But if you look into to something new that you haven't linked into, you want to seek it first. Seek and you shall find. Now you found it. Knock and the door will be open. Now, once the door is open, you link into it. All right. How shall a man they say they say they say uh, uh, unless a man is born again, he cannot see the kingdom of God. What does that mean? When you born again, that means that when you go into that second life, that meditation, the first time you open your eyes up as a baby, that's when you born the first time. But when you open your third eye, as when you get older, that's when you're born again. And that's when you see the kingdom of God. The kingdom of God is within you, which means that you don't have to go on the outside of yourself to find the kingdom of God because the kingdom of God is within you. There's nothing on the outside that can give you power. Everything goes on the inside because the kingdom of God is the cosmos. And you are the gods of this world. And the cosmos is your kingdom. Nature is your kingdom. Understand this? Insurrection must begin. You must rise up on the inside in order to rise up on the outside. And once you rise up on the inside, you're taking a whole new toll on life. A whole new toll on the powers that's around you. All right, guys. I hope this was very helpful for those of you guys who are asking, how do you awaken Because it's important that we understand that insurrection must take take place. The rising up within you, going into your state of meditation, filtering through all the lies that have been told from the time that you were a child or until now. Highly important, my people, because all your powers are within you. And we talked about the crystals, the energies, the the meditation. The sun is on the outside of us as well as on the inside of us. The crystals that we have on the outside of us are all on the inside of us. The radiation on the outside of us is on the inside of us. The planets that are on the outside of us are on the inside of us. Uranium come from our kidneys. Uranus, plutonium come from our liver and our and our and 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 our uh, uh, um, lungs, because our lungs and livers are have full of pure, pure plutonium. That's from Pluto. Cesium comes from the planet. Uh, 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 um, I forgot the name of the planet. I gotta get it. I forgot the name of the planet. It slipped my mind. But all of these elements that's within side of us come from other planetary bodies. So that means that. That planetary body on the outside, when they say Pluto and all that, is also on the inside of us. And this is the awakening. There's no amount of money that you can spend to awaken yourself because it's all free. Knowledge is free. The energy is free. It's all free. If anybody tell you you have to come and pay for a meditation session, you get the fuck away from them. Why should I have to pay for something when I'm getting something for free? That's why I give out this all this information. I don't I don't ask anyone for no money. Oh, just send your donations to this and send donations for that. No, I don't ask for any money. I only requested money that one time when I had that really heavy problem. That basement. That's all. I don't ask for money. I don't require to be paid for knowledge because nature pays me. Nature takes care of me. Just like I take care of everyone else. Okay, guys. So, insurrection, rising up on the inside of you. That's the beginning of your awakening. For those of you who don't know, for those of you who know. All power to the multi-chakra celestial energy beings. Peace to you all.